Hi my lovelies, I hope you're all well. So today I'm going to show you how to do a technique called snap weeding. Now snap weeding can be very hit and miss, I'm not going to lie about that, but when it works, it makes life so much easier, it really does. Now I only advise doing snap weeding with certain vinyls, so you really want to be using things like 651, 631, just normal Cricut vinyl. You don't want to be using foils, glitters, anything like that. You just want kind of flat vinyls. So we're going to be using Cricut vinyl today. You can see I've got my design here. This is from Design Bundles. I think it's super cute. Uh, I will link to it in the description below. So I don't really want to do anything to it except to come in and I'm going to weld or attach today. Uh, I think I'm just going to attach it all. So it's all going to cut out on one mat. We can then go to make it and then to continue and we're just going to select vinyl as our cut today and of course you, I'm using the maker but if you're using an air or an air 2 you'll be able to select vinyl as well. So it's all cut out, so I'm just going to remove it from my mat. And then I'm just going to come in with a pair of scissors and I'm just going to cut away the excess. And then I'm going to come back in and just place it back on my mat. The reason for this is I want it to be nice and secure. So I want it to not move around and the best way to do that is to have it back on the mat. So the next bit is the bit where you need to calm yourself and you need to be confident in what you're doing. It doesn't always work, as I say, it can be hit and miss. There is a knack to it. Once you get that knack down, it actually becomes really, really easy. And the way I started doing it when I first started doing snap weeding was I hold my breath and I pull and then I breathe. Um, and I actually found this worked for me. I, as I say, you do want to be using kind of basic adhesive vinyls. So the Cricut vinyl's fine, it's just a Cricut kind of sheen vinyl. 651, 631, anything like that is great. Things like glitters, foils, opals, holographics, anything like that, you're going to have problems doing this with. So you do want to kind of stick to your basic vinyls. So we're just going to come in and we're just going to grab a corner. And you just want to grab it with your thumb and your forefinger and you want to really, really hold on to it. You're then going to place your other hand down onto your backing sheet and you are going to calm yourself and you are then going to rip. So as I say, I always take a deep breath and then I just rip it off. And there you see we've got all that pulled up in just one movement. And again, I'm just going to hold it with my thumb and my forefinger. I'm going to hold down on my backing sheet. And I'm just going to come in and rip. There we go, that's taken that all off in one. And then of course we've just got this little bit here so we can just come in and remove that. And we have then removed all of that weeding in kind of three goes, which is absolutely fantastic. So I'm going to go cut another one out now. This time I'm going to cut it out in 651 just to show you that you can do it with different types of vinyl. <laughs> 